You are looking live at Bryant Denny Stadium in Tuscaloosa, Alabama, on an Iron Bowl Saturday night. For an entire year, this drama has been building. For Auburn, the memory of kick six is the sweetest ever. For Alabama, the pain still lingers. All games matter to the Tide faithful, but this game matters most of all. He motions out, and Marshall flares, and he drops. Was that a lateral? Alabama claims it was. Raglan jumps on the ball. The headlinesman agrees. That's Amari Cooper motioning out. Come right back with Yeldon. Huge hole. Out of bounds at the Tiger 15-yard line on the field. Power with Yeldon. Touchdown, Alabama. Artis Payne on the draw play. First down, Jesse, on cue, you said that Artis Payne is the player they wanted to get involved. Here is Marshall. He burned Bama a year ago for a big run. Colorado. Auburn's on the board. Fowler, good receiver, motions out. He's also a fine lead blocker as he throws right there for Cooper. And Amari Cooper with Whitehead finally getting him out of bounds, but not before Cooper picked up a first down. Sims, high, leaping grab at the 18-yard line by O.J. Howard, a tight end. By Alabama's tight end. Three of three. Here's his fourth throw, and he wants the end zone. Cooper got a touchdown, Bama. Second down and eight. Play action artist Payne going deep to Williams in the air with those great hands of his. And Auburn is suddenly at the 15. This man is healthy. We talked about Alabama is scoring touchdowns. Auburn is kicking field goals. Artist Payne explodes. 47-yard line and another Tiger first down. 11, Corey Grant. The fake, Marshall fires, complete, and that's Williams. Three of them. First down and 10 now for Bama. Sims in the pocket. Intercepted. Picked up by Whitehead. Eyes on this turnover. Marshall. Touchdown, Auburn. Sammy Coates. Motions out. Made sure that was a forward pass. First down, Bama. Number 45 is carrying the load right now. For is lined up in the backfield, and now they're going to send him out as a receiver. Sims dances. Sideline and Jones. Christian Jones inside the 10 yard line. Yeldon, touchdown, Alabama regains the lead. Going deep again. Got a man. Touchdown, Sammy Coates, his second of the night. It was man-to-man -man coverage outside, Brent, with Eddie Jackson, who Sammy Coates beat earlier on a... Sims, middle, his second interception of the game. This one picked off by Ford. They've got 38 seconds. They've got the ball across midfield with Bray. And they're going to throw off the reverse. Marshall wants to go deep in zone. Trickeration, caught. And that was Coates. It'll be first and goal with 28 seconds. 
Gus Malzahn promised him some, promised us some trickeration tonight, and here it is. They line up. Artis Payne, the Auburn running back. Payne stopped by the middle of that defensive front. Reed throws him back, number 90. Perfect. 26 21. Picked off again, his third interception. Jonathan Jones. And Jonathan saw that one coming from a mile away. And now Saban and the Bama staff, they've got a decision to make. Bray on the end of round sweeps for the first down to the 20-yard line. Touchdown, Auburn. Quan Bray. Stick with Sims right now. Yeldon's the running back. Yeldon bolts. Sims drops the flare to White. White going for the edge and the first down. Let's see where they spot that it. It is close. It is very close. Lane Kiffin was trying to help him out. Ford was there defensively, and that's the first down signal wow. from our referee, Cuba. Play action. Sims has time. Goes. Cooper's wide open. Touchdown, Alabama. Missed it. It was blocked. That was Blackson who blocked it. Marshall steps into the throw. Double coverage. Tug of war going down with Duke Williams. Duke Williams is hanging on right now. Ty goes tug to the receiver. With Collins. Ty goes the to the receiver. The says indeed it goes to the receiver. What a catch by Duke Williams. Marshall. Goes deep, one-on-one -on -one coverage, battle. Quan Bray is on the outside, battling for the ball. And it's a wow. catch, the headlinesman said. The catch against Sylvie, working that far side. On Bray with Brandon Sylvie. He jumps up over top. You know, he gets both feet down. 33-yarder is good eliminate them potentially from the playoff possibility sims gonna go deep on cooper cooper's got it touchdown alabama they're showing gap pressure then they back off rush four marshall though in a foot race on the move, right side, up for grabs, intercepted at the 45 by Perry, Nick Perry. And Alabama will have a first down in Auburn territory. Again, it's Cooper on the move. To the eight-yard line, Whitehead hanging on. And that was a confident throw by Blake Sims. Sims looking back at number nine, and now he's going to take off. Slips into the end zone. Touchdown, Alabama. Our fourth lead change of this game. And it's caught for the two-point conversion. That was... DeAndre White on third down. Marshall not going to get close. Taken down at the 22-yard line. Robinson is still missing in action. And here is Yeldon midfield. And he runs to the 39-yard line. Play action. Sims. Wide open is Cooper. 
Full out. Touchdown, White. DeAndre White, the senior from Houston, Texas, on senior day, scores the touchdown, and the tide rolling. Rolling to the right in a foot race, sends his down. Play action, Marshall. Going to come deep downfield. And Coates has got it at the 15-yard line. He had two first-half touchdowns. Geno Smith, and they're not out of bullets yet. Fires in underneath. Alabama football. The hand to Henry, and Henry breaks free. 40, 45, crosses midfield, still going to the 25-yard line with Mincy making the stop on Henry. Here's Henry, swinging wide, breaks free, end zone. That could be the dagger. Forced out on the move. And fires and coming back. That was Quan Bray. <laughs> this will kill it momentarily with this first down. Grant to the 14-yard line. Different than that of Alabama's. Corey Grant dives for the end zone and an Auburn touchdown. Marshall on the move gonna run for it gonna pick it up that way in 18 seconds that memory has been erased Alabama wins the highest scoring Iron Bowl in history